What's up students? James again, teaching aid number two. This time we're going to learn the blues, or at least you should be learning the blues already. I'm just going to play them so that you can have something to look at during the week. Now, most of us learn the blues in sixth and in, in fifth position here on the fifth string. Um, and others of you learned it down here. So I'm going to play briefly through both of them. But as far as the the one that starts on the fifth fret, first finger, fifth fret, third finger, seventh fret on the A string. Here we go. back at the beginning. Now for the rest of you who started down here on the lower end, it goes like this. And, uh, Along with each of these positions, um, there's a soloing pattern um, that is commonly used in almost every every blues player, guitarist guy out there. Some of you have learned this, some of you have not, but if you haven't learned it, here it is. In the fifth position, it goes like this. That's a minor pentatonic position, commonly used in almost every blues, rock, anything genre out there. That's that. And as far as the, the lower position is concerned, it would be the same exact pattern just move down five frets. So if you imagine this is actually a fret, the nut is actually a fret, we start there and do the same thing. See it? So we have the same sort of licks. That last section, I forgot to mention, it's actually a 12-bar blues, and that means that there's 12 measures. If you remember, it's 6-8, so there's 6 beats per measure. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. And each 6 beats is a measure called a bar in blues. So that's the 12-bar blues. Um, when I play blues for fun, I'm usually playing a 24-bar blues, which is basically um, everything times 2. So it's just really stretched out and easier to solo on and whatnot. Um, but what I showed you was just just one riff that you can play. Um, there's a million different ones, you know, and you can make them up as you go along. But um, a different way of playing it would be. Gotta add the attitude to it. Mm. See what I'm doing with the anchor? I'm muting. Then you just break into a solo and let your heart fly. Teach.
Okay, fellas and girls, that's it for the blues for this time. It's just an introductory video, so we didn't cover everything by a long shot. But I hope you enjoyed it, and I hope you enjoy playing the blues. Have a good time. See ya.